Happy Saturday, everybody. It's your boy, X-Man991, coming to you back again with another anniversary rant. We are winding down to the end of Black Music Month. Another anniversary of a classic album, and it's right here. June 29th, 2004, 12 days after my 13th birthday, Lloyd Banks released his debut album, The Hunger for More, under G-Unit Interscope Records. Of course, this album hit number one on the Billboard 200 and number one on the top R&B slash hip hop albums chart and was certified platinum with the three singles, Karma, On Fire, and I'm So Fly. With guest appearances from, of course, 50 Cent, Snoop, Nate Dogg, Eminem, The Game, Young Buck, KC, and Tony Ayo. Eight years later, or seven years later, Lloyd Banks released the sequel to The Hunger For More, The Hunger For More 2, on November 22, 2010. Or six years later, excuse me. This album is definitely one of my favorites from the year 2004. Lloyd Banks was only 22 years old when he released this album. Today, he's 42 years old. This album still holds up 20 years later. It's definitely one of my favorites. This album is my shit, man. I've been dying to celebrate the 20th anniversary of this album since the 10th anniversary in 2014. And now the album is the big 2-0. One more year, and this album is old enough to drink. Congratulations, Lloyd Banks, on 20 years of your classic masterpiece album. I would highly recommend this to y'all if you haven't listened to it. And we also have other albums that came out on this day in 2004. I know Akon released his debut album, Trouble. And we have another rapper whose album is turning 20 years old this year, but I don't give a damn about it. I'm not even going to mention him. But this rant is all about this album right here. Lloyd Banks, The Hunger for More. He's without a doubt one of the most underrated rappers of all time. He's one of my favorites of the 2000s decade, next to Lupe Fiasco. That's going to wrap up my quick rant celebrating 20 years of Lloyd Banks, The Hunger for More album. I like this album, but in my opinion, his best album is Rotten Apple. So let me know what you guys think about this album, looking back on it 20 years later. If you're new here, if you like the content, hit subscribe, hit that notification bell for my next anniversary rant. Give this video a thumbs up if you like the video and leave your comment down below and I'll catch you in my next video. Play stupid games, win stupid prizes. No more talk. Happy 20th anniversary to Lloyd Banks, The Hunger for More.